we wanted to add some chamber lighting to our Voron 2.4. There's a great mod for this by Eddie the Engineer called LED Bar Clips. These strips are 18 LEDs long, spaced 16.6 millimeters apart. If your strip has this coating on it, you're going to want to carefully peel it off. Prep the pads and wires and then solder the main input wires to the LED strip. Now we can install the bar clips. Just uh, slide them over like that and make sure you got them aligned properly. We left this one clip off at the end so you can access the pads for the outputs on the output wires. With that done, we slide the final clip into place for this side and repeat on the other strip. Make sure you align the clips properly and load this strip up, then we're ready to go and put them into the chamber. We remove the top panel for ease of access and then place the strip into position. Seating these can be a little tricky. Use extra care as you get them slotted into position. Repeat for the other side and make sure your input wires are facing the right direction. We use these printed cable covers from Jasper KM to cover up the wires. You can find the link in the description. Our stealth burner isn't on our LED port on the Octopus, so we're going to use the BL Touch header here to drive the chamber lights. Add a few lines to your printer config file and tell it about your new chamber lights. And just look how much of a difference good chamber lighting makes. Thanks for watching.